The security at the Art Institute was very interesting. There were barriers in front of the artifacts. However, they were very small and served as more of a reminder than the actual measure of security. Probably so it doesn't interfere with the viewing of the artifacts. There were security guards everywhere, and most took their jobs very seriously by denying a request for a picture. However, we did want get one to say yes for this project. There was a security guard in basically every gallery, and on top of protecting the art, they were there to guide people and give some information about the art. The relaxed approach to security at the Art Institute shows the trust they put into the visitors' respect for the art. However, if there were any incidents, I would imagine they would become stricter with security. Gallery names are named off of people who donate lots of money to allow people to see art that can be used to enhance knowledge of history. They are named after those people, and it puts opinions of what the art is based on, the people who donate, rather than the true meaning of each piece. People are changed by the dynamic of the ropes on the floor and the guards watching you. The unwritten rules of being quiet and not interrupting people while they are interpreting art make people change their behavior, makes them more on task as well as knowing more and seeing more about the themes of each piece. The museum is designed in a way so art can be seen from all sides. The all glass cases and the open concept make the experience very pleasing for the viewer. The rooms are all connected and from some angles, viewers have the ability to see into neighboring rooms with more unique art. The height of the ceiling and the amount of windows in certain areas of the museum really help show the wealth of the museum besides the art. The image slanting downward from above gives the viewer a better angle to see the whole piece from below. The attention to detail and little things like this is what makes the Art Institute great.